Clenny, like I want some ish balling meat. <laughs> what the heck? Yo, what is up, guys? I'm here today with a live reaction to you already know what time it is Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood, episode 23. And we'll see how this goes. Right now, I'm just waiting for the episode to like load up. I'm on, you know, on YouTube with it. Not YouTube, uh, I'm on, you know, like I'm on with a laptop, so I'm, you know, watching it. I don't have it downloaded. What the heck? This is taking forever? Yeah, but last episode, with freaking Winry and Scar. Ah, oh, man, X Scar, whatever you call him. Yo, that was, a, that was a moment right there. Like, I didn't know how to react. How would you react in that situation? You feel me? You have to ask yourself that sometimes. Like, all right, let's go. X. So, freaking heck, man, like I kept pausing it to move back, but it would just, like, bring an ad or something. Like, what? Let me make it full screen. Yo, why does full screen never work here? Oh my goodness, this laptop. <laughs> I'm trying to enjoy, look full screen, lay back, relax, but it's not working. Let me move it up. You might see the um thing, so if you see the head of the laptop, my apologies guys. I mean, not that it, I don't think it's a big deal, right? Yo, this opening is amazing. Like, listening to it all these times, it just makes you think and look at it again and say like this opening is just really good like this and especially the time it was coming out did it full metal alchemist brotherhood air like in 2011 rarely speak on the opening like full metal alchemist like i really speak on its opening song or anything like that but it's really amazing honestly i just hope this video like doesn't buffer because what's it called i just had to restart the opening because it started buffering i hate that The girl on the battlefield. Yo, what's going on? Oh, yeah, Bradley and us. Good. Good, he can't chase us now. Oh, this is, I right, remember this. Gluttony, he's on us. He's on our ass. Oh man. Would we we gotta go? But it's sad that we have to leave her in this state, like she's crying, you know, she like she just went through the worst thing, meeting the killer of your parents, and you had the opportunity to take him out. Look at that. Winry. <laughs> it's funny because they were just here. Like, what the heck? Wait, you wear glasses, Hawkeye. <laughs> Hawkeye's just making sure that like, he knows in his head that you can't come stay out of this. Ling, you shouldn't run into, you know, places like this where there's no people. You know how I look at it. He should run in the open where there's a lot of people. Because then it's like, they, Bradley can't really show himself out in the open. Because people will see him. You know, you guys kind of get what I'm saying. Use people to your advantage. There will be too many heads watching for them to, to do anything drastic. You see how fans hang is wiggling. It's broken. Mm. 
That's true. You know, it's funny. It, like, they need each other. The people and the king. You know, Ling gives me that, um, saber vibe. Yo. Yo, Fan did not just try to kill herself. Yo, in order so, she's like, I'm gonna kill myself, then you're gonna leave me? Yo, look at this battle, though! What the heck? Yo! That's true. Don't let hard things make your life miserable. It's, you know, I like the fact that Scar also had a brother, you know, X, he had a brother himself. And now for Al to have a brother, it kind of, to an extent, it's, you know, like they should be able to understand. Nice. Right in the nick of time, Ed. I mean, I don't blame Ed too much for that. Gluttony? Glenny, like I want some ish balling meat. <laughs> what the heck? Yo! Whoa! Sit down, Glenny! What? You know, now that I'm thinking about it, right? Sit, what's it called? Wait, I thought he would destroy him right away. That's what I was just gonna say. There's more blood. No, he didn't. He's regenerating. But we know now that if we kill Glut a number of times, he eventually, you know, will die. Yo, Lee is looking cool. She cut her arm! They use a dog to, you know, to basically lead a direction where blood is. Oh, wow, Fan. What a coincidence we found a dog, thank goodness! Who's that? Guys, are you guys kidding me? Still worry about who that is? Jump, put them in the cart. You know what I mean? Hawkeye, like, I'll leave this to you. Oh, yeah, come on, guys, undercover. But it's like Hawkeye, we can still tell it to you, man. I don't want Scar to get captured though. He's trying to leave? Damn! Yo! X like I'm not gonna go without a fight. Look! I forgot this girl's name! Um What's her name again? Oh, yeah? I remember 
remember she was with X. But doesn't she like Ed? She's with Zing. Yo, that's cool. That's pretty cool. She doesn't know that's Ed. Because I remember, like, a few episodes ago, she was in love with Ed. Lovey dovey. Come on, Hawkeye, we have to. She's hurt. But you know what would suck? If because we do this, we lose this upper hand we have? Oh my goodness, yo! What the heck? Because we went... Because we, you know what sucks so much about this? Because we went to get Fan and help her teammate. You know, Hawkeye was like, we don't have much time, let's stop it. If we never did that, if you think about it, we might have not been able to be seen from Bradley and now he's not on to us. What the heck? Oh, brother, that really sucks. What's her name again? Please, say her name. <laughs> you know, poor panda! He, he fits in Owl's hand like that! He's the size of his hand! <laughs> Yo, Owl's in love? <laughs> Yo, she... <laughs> Now he's like, someone's up top the food class. Aw, oh, man, Winry. What the heck? That really sucks, guys. The whole situation with freaking Bradley. Can't trust this snake. I wonder what they were talking about. Ah. Uh. Oh, brother. I don't know how someone could be so fake. How? Because it's like, I see this part of Bradley and I'm like, yo, I kind of like him. You know what I mean? But then you, you see the true darkness. That's so sad to know.
Who could it be? Look at that, they want one we back! Oh, yeah. Yo, look at the customers! You know why I like this though, kinda? Cause you see, it shows winery. Like you still have people that care about you. Like exactly to what Ed said, winery, your hands shouldn't be used for harming, but instead fixing and helping. This is beautiful. Oh. Uh, you got a wife, Winry, yo! That's what I keep saying. Winry is wife material. What did he say? What the heck did he say? I, like, I'll make it up to you or something. Tears of joy, I'll make you cry tears of joy. Why did he have such a big back? Always had a big back? I fell in love with him! love with him. Doctor? <laughs> oh? Oh yeah, true. Mustang cares? You know, he's like, Why though? Is it because what you saw in Ishbal? That's, you know, it's going to be not sanitized? Ooh. Oh, Ling is so hurt right now. That's his, you know, his friend, someone he cares so much about. Oh man, poor fan. Oh. 
Oh, oh, she that. Oh, you know what's? Oh yeah, she did the same using the arm. Come in, Ling. Come on, go see her. What? Wait. Never mind. I thought I was onto something. Lin, come on, go in there. <laughs> gluttony. You know, you know what I'll do to gluttony, right? I'll just kick him. Random kicks. <laughs> Yeah, Bradley. You think I didn't know this? Right on his eye patch. You see? I don't know how he does it. That's true. Wait. Oh, he was adopted. I don't think, I mean, Gluttony is kind of, no offense, he's kind of an idiot. We can just give him food, he'll speak. Guys, you're too loud? That's the one who killed... Look! Guys! Go! Oh! He's gonna rip out! He's like, you killed my lost! What? Yo. You know what's crazy, guys? I'm watching the episode, right? And I'm like, you know what? I'm gonna just keep this a single. It feels like it's ending. Next, you know, we freaking go into the next, like, the final bits of the episode. Gluttony! He's mad! He's like, you're Roy Mustang! You can't lust! And he's opening up his stomach! He's- What the- What the heck? I need to continue then! Definitely! What? Same Roy Mustang that killed lust! That's what he's thinking? Episode 24, guys! Let's jump right into this, man! Ixo! This freaking yo! This internet is so bad, guys! It keeps buffering! Like, it, it took forever for this to, you know, pop up. Hopefully it does not buffer and I can get this reaction over with. Because I, I don't, I want to finish, like, I'd rather not have this buff. I want to watch the reaction and enjoy it. I hate buffering and it makes editing the video harder for me. Because then I have to, like, if it buffers and it stops somewhere, I have to replay it from that area we stopped. Sync it all together. It's so tedious, man. Please stop buffering, yo. Gluttony. Gluttony is no joke now. He's angry. As soon as he heard Mustang's name. And you saw the thing he opened up in his stomach with the eye. You know what I remembered? Like, not what I remembered, but what I thought of when I saw that. Like, the gates? Like, something like that. I don't know why. Even Ed had, like, an expression. Like, he was like, yo, I've seen that before. Or, like, what the heck? Maybe it was, like, a what the heck expression. Who knows? Come on, don't buffer no more. But at least everyone knows about Bradley. Now, that's the thing. 
Now they know about Bradley, he's a homunculus. Cause see, the thing is, they didn't know he was a homunculus. Lynn got them to know that, you know what I mean? They didn't know. Now they know. Who are you talking to? Oh, <gasps> Dr. Marco, they have him, but we knew he was taken. Ed and Al are that, right? You know, the city is like a transmutation circle, right? Isn't it? Cause like if you look at the city like from the, a sky view down, it looks like a circle or something. Look at that, blackmail. This is so messed up. These homunculus. inside the belly. Who's talking to you? Look at that Bradley. You're taking these L's. But who's talking to you? Look at that. Bradley, not too bad. Yo, you see, this is the thing. It looks like Bradley. Like, he's, you know? Like, he's, he's not, what the heck? Maybe Bradley is not as bad as we think. He's showing signs of, you know? What he said at the, right there. Yo, look at that! Clean the gun in half! What's going on in there? Whoa! Wait, I was gonna say, what happened to Mustang's face? Come on, let's get out of here quick. I feel bad for, you know, Lan Fan, because she's injured. You know, moving when you're injured is the worst. That's true. That's true. We let him go, he's gonna go talk to Bradley, chit chat, you know? He's eating the fire? Uh. <laughs> They're like, 
like Mustang get away from us, yo, run the opposite direction. Mustang's injuries. What's that? What was that? What the heck? Those were the dogs or something, right? Was that a dog? I don't know. But didn't what's it called have dogs? When she was talking to the doctor? Look, a fake? Please tell me you guys escaped. Mustang, look at you! Seriously, this stupid <laughs> That's true. Yep. We're gonna fight? We managed to catch him. We'll end this. But you know what? Why I think Mustang wouldn't want this. You know why? Because Mustang, he cares about people's well-being. They're kids. They're young. So much to live for. Start families. All of that. We don't use guns. Put down the guns, yo. Say no to the guns. Is he gonna take it? No. Oh, he is? Please! Man, these episodes! You only live one life, man. Live it to the... That's my mentality in life. You only got one life to live. Live it to the fullest. You go early, you go early. At least you enjoyed life. No regrets, none of that. Lust must have treated Gluttony well, you know? Gluttony cares so much about lust. The homunculus must love each other, if you think about it. What's there? I knew I saw a dog! What?! Oh, it's a thing! Not a thing, the girl! Or the- I don't know what you are if you're a girl or a boy. I think this is a girl, right? Yeah, it's a girl. It's a girl, what the heck? It's a girl. No, that's Envy. Yeah, I think Envy is a girl. Envy doesn't want to fight? We have to kill Glenny, he knows too much?
<laughs> what? You know, it's like this is supposed to be a serious moment, but they're still making funny. I like it. It's funny because look at what your father really does. Peace. <laughs> he wants to sacrifice you all. Peace, my foot. You know the thing though! Look! That's cool! That Envy could do that! That's really cool! Exactly too homunculus. Stop! Uh, don't underestimate us. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, gluttony running because he knows he can't eat us. Look, you can't get him. Oh. What happened? Everything got swallowed just right now. Look. What? And Lynn. Spit him out, you bitch. Start throwing up. And you're closing it up. Right now, I would be punch, punching gluttony up. What the heck? You can't close your mouth. I'm confused, right? I mean, I'm not confused. He swallowed them up so they go to another dimension, right? That's true. You're weak. Look, you're armless. You don't have an arm yet. Heal up. You can fight another day. Rest. Ah, oh, I feel so bad for her. What the heck? Glenny! Yo, I need closure, guys.
exactly. I'm agreeing with the doctor right now. Because it's like, you guys are not, you know, with stuff like this, let time pass a little bit. I know you don't want to wait, but... Because you don't, you know, you don't get victory overnight. It takes time. You just gotta... I don't know. Use <laughs> Did you get a love Hawkeye? Eleven lost twelve. The <laughs> Ravens gonna <laughs> Ravens gonna lose it. Don't you dare put dirt on my name. <laughs> Look at this. My goodness, yo! It's corrupted! What the hell? 
hey, you know, at a point I was thinking we could trust those guys, but then I'm like, you know, in my head though, I'm like, this is the army, this is the army, it's all under, you know, Bradley, these people work for Bradley, they're gonna speak to Bradley, this whole place is corrupted, there's no, next episode guys, you see, the thing is, there's no one, no one we can go to here to talk to. That's the thing. There's no one we can go to look for advice right here. Because the situation is, Bradley is the top dog and you guys are under him. So it's like anything you say will be used against you. You kind of get what I'm trying to say. Bradley, he he runs this. He's the top. No one's good. Everyone's under him. They're, they're either, let me... One sec, let me just get the video and pause it. But yeah, like, he's a, he's a top dog, you feel me? Everyone's either afraid of him, or they respect him to a point where they can't, you know, stand up to him. It's either you're afraid enough that you can't stand up to him, or you respect him to a point where you're like, no, there's no way that's possible, and you don't want to stand up to him. And that's what, you know, I don't know how Mustang could escape this situation, because isn't that like um treachery right there? What Mustang is doing? Like, they're just gonna be like, oh, whose side are you on? Are you not in the military side? Couldn't that get you, like, expelled or suspended? Or is something like that, you know, along those lines? Like, they'll be like, remove, like, derank him, put him down a rank, or, you know, take him, just completely wipe him out the military from that. Like, that's what I'm saying? Like, what he did there is very risky. I can't, like, I didn't, at first when I was, you know, watching and seeing everything go along, I didn't think, it, I thought those guys, they were people who we could trust that were against, you know, Bradley. And that's why they're like, yo, let, let us know about this information. But then as soon as Bradley pops up and he's like, what's this I hear about me being a homunculus? And I feel like when Mustang should, says, show us your eye patch or something like that. Show us your eye. What's under that eye so we can prove that you're a homunculus. It's going to be a, a, a destroyed eye or something like that. Like, you know, I mean, not, it's not going to be a real eye, but, a, like, you know, because why would they put a real eye? Because then it's like, why do you have an eye patch if you have a good eye there? It's going to be like a d damaged eye and he'll say, you, like, something from the battle he's been through or something like fighting for the country. A damaged eye and then he's going to show them that. And, you know, they're just going to be like, yo, Mustang, what are you on? You know? But guys, let's jump right into this. It looks like even though the episode was paused, it didn't move up an inch. Episode 25, Ixo. Please don't buffer, man. I think I'll stop at this one. I'll go through maybe four. I'll see how it goes. Yo, what the heck? Cause see today it's like I'm enjoying Full Metal Alchemist too much right now. That's it. I need closure, guys. I I don't want to react to anything but this right now. And he's a like freaking gluttony stomach. You know he's easing his body. I love the beat. I wonder when I can watch the opening. That's what I'm wondering right now. How long more do I have to wait? Cause you know, like I don't watch openings cause of spoilers and stuff like that, but I still love openings, you know? As soon as I get the chance to watch, I watch and I enjoy the visuals, the music with it as well. Let me get my water, where is it? Really? In gluttony's stomach? What do you eat, man? It, it's a whole village? A whole island or something? Fire? Oh, the fire makes sense because of Mustang? When Mustang uses fire and gluttony ate it. Lin, where are you? <laughs> Is that all blood that we're in? <laughs> you know that's crazy!
<laughs> what the heck, Ed? You're not doing nothing? Straight the head? Straight to the head? <laughs> doing roundhouse kicks and all of that. How do we get out of this situation? That's what I'm saying. Unless it's a different round. The car? Yep. Guys, I would be so scared. Think about it, you're in his stomach! Oh, you look? Al's arm? Yeah, we need to get out of here ASAP. How do you? Oh my good, <laughs> cut it out. <laughs> Telepathic abilities. He needs to shit us out. That's true. Look at that. <laughs> They're going mad to escape. But we have to be careful there as well, because since we're in Gluttony's mouth, there's a couple things we need to worry about. Envy is there, that's first things first. Second thing, second, he's going to digest us. Aww. Wow. Abandoned. And Lin's clan is the highest? You're both weak, is that what you're saying? Not weak, but more like you have no, you know, power? Hopeless. <laughs> what? Still took her in? Oh, this is adorable. <laughs> if you pre present it to him, you get a reward? That's what Lynn's trying to do as well. Everyone here from Zing is trying to do that, you know, immortality. <laughs> Fell on his head. Oh, X. X! Why do you have to be so loud, though? You know what I mean? Oh. 
wrong. It's not like we could punch our way out either. This looks hopeless. Lynn, don't give up. Yeah, come on, word man, get up. Nah, don't leave him behind, Ed. Ed! Ed, don't leave him behind! You know, the only bad thing about Ed doing this is because we know Envy's still here. Envy could trap us. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Ed. I knew Ed wasn't going to leave Lynn behind. That's not like Ed, you know what I mean? Look, we're on a platform now. Guys, I wouldn't even trust anything to eat down here. Are you- Oh my- Are we really this hopeless? Is this- Is this a fact, guys? <laughs> you can't- Come on, you have to push it! We really ate- Oh my goodness! You know times are hard when you're eating leather boots. You need someone to push you like Alice pushing Ed. They're pushing each other, you know? It's probably Envy. Envy, how do we get out of this place? Because you see the thing with Envy. Envy's kind of cool. I can't even lie. I feel like we need to learn more about these homunculus. Then where are we? Where are we? Is it the gates? I knew it! Didn't I mention the I.O.? Gate of Truth? We're in there? What the heck? Gluttony is a portal to the gate of truth? Oh. Oh, never mind. He's a fake. <laughs> He's a fake, yo. Wow. What? No way. There's a way out. No, I'm not going to accept that. Just like that. You guys see, I noticed the eye. 
being the gate, I noticed it. Ed, you have another leather boot. Because we're going to be here a while. So who is it? What? Speak! That's what we've been told? What? They started the war? You see? What? X! You have the energy on the wrong people? Envy? The war was started to philosopher stones! Wow! Unbelievable! Look at that poor kid! All the sacrifices. I will, yo. Envy in the face? Punch him! And you just killed many innocent people! Wow! The rock bells! Exactly! What the heck, man? Every time we're getting answers, though, you know, we're learning more. He's strong? She? He? Envy? Envy's a boy? I was thinking Envy was just, Is Envy a trap? What is Envy? Is it is Envy one of those boy girls? Girls that look like boys or boys that look like girls situation? Sorry about that guys if I'm mistaking Envy too much for like a girl and boy. <laughs> this is something else. But just to think Envy's the root of this all, the homunculus, all that murder, mass killing. Oh my goodness, it sucks. You know, I'm happy that we learn more information. Every episode, Glenny, Glenny, off limits. You're not you're taking no bite. Wow. I love the fact that we, wow. You know what's crazy? Ow! Talk to Gluttony, you can get information!
Look at that. They're all in on this. You can't trust anyone. Oh, fake. Oh, fake. She was crying. Hawkeye Everyone's being transferred Separating Look Transferring us? You're transferred as well? Central Headquarters. <gasps> what? You see, Mustang, I told you, bro, take baby steps. Baby steps. You were too fast. This is not overnight stuff. Now look at how we're separated. What? We can't fight Envy! We have to fight? Oh, brother. You know, I always wondered, I, I haven't gotten my ribs broke before, but how would people know? I guess they feel their rib is down or something like that, you know what I mean? I always notice in animes and stuff, they're like, I broke my rib? Where? Your father is in Central. Central! But it's not Bradley! Oh yeah, but we do know the- Yo, what the- Oh my- Guys, oh my goodness! Oh... Should I do one more? One more? Let me look at how much minutes is left in the camera! One minute- What? Not one minute, I mean an hour and two minutes! An hour and two minutes, yo. You know what? 
Just one more! Just one more, yo! Just one more, this is it though. Nothing else after this, just this one. But you see, we do know that um like the father is in central. We knew that before, like they have like some base or something like that hidden there where they are. But you see, I believe, I don't know, I believe their father is Hohenheim. That's what I'm thinking they're referring to. Cause I, I remember, like they were they were talking to this dude, he was in a, like a white robe, and he looked like Hohenheim, guys. He looked like Hohenheim. But I could be wrong, and that could be like someone completely different. But that's what I'm thinking. And if their father, and you know, from like a, I believe a few episodes, something was presented that made you think it was Hohenheim. They mentioned their father, and then it goes back to Hohenheim, yo. So if Hohenheim is their father, oh dear. That, how messed up is that? And your son is a human sacrifice. Hohenheim, what type of man are you? But like I said, maybe I'm just overthinking it. You know, and sh you know, it's not the case. And I'm just making Hohenheim in my head look like a bad person. Because honestly, from the, like, when I was introduced to Hohenheim, I don't want him to succeed, guys. I don't like Hohenheim. Not that I don't like him, but I feel like, all right, not that I don't like him, but I feel like he's a deadbeat as a father. Like, he's a bad dad. But who knows? Like I said, we need to see from his perspective. You always need to see what someone else was going through before you can judge or say anything. And once you get the full story, then you judge and you say your opinions. You know what I mean? But let's jump right into this. Episode 26. Hopefully there's no buffering, yo. Eek, so. What the heck? These episodes, guys! Guys, I'm deaf. I have to stop here. I have to. I have to, guys. Oh, my goodness. And we're trapped. Not only are we trapped in Gluttony's stomach, we have to fight. Envy, and Envy's like this huge dog thing. Man, everyone being transferred. What the heck? You see, we, oh man, we should have took, we should have approached things differently, you know what I mean? Mustang was too hasty. How do we redeem ourselves here? That's what I'm thinking. How do we get everything back to the way it was? There's no way! And Central. But you know what's good about this? Glenny! Like I said, I'm not trying to say Glenny is stupid or anything, but Glenny is not the brightest. He can lead us to Father. Glenny can help us in so many ways right now. Like, I was thinking, you know, I didn't think Glenny would take us to his father, but I think he would, I thought he would tell us about his father, or, you know, tell us things. Lynn going fast? create multiple spikes to stab what what the heck it's all a trick envy is a trickery trickster are these all the people envy killed that she keeps a, mem a memento of or something Like I'm saying, can't and do something like that. Create spikes that could stab into it. And snap out of it. This will kill you. No! Nina! Freaking Envy! Cut it out! And... 
YOU GET THAT STUFF OFF OF US! AND! Lin can't do anything! AND! WE NEED YOU! AND! AND WHAT THE EGG MAN! It's like we need- oh man! We need Ed to snap out of it and come to it. How? Yo, what the heck is this situation Ed's in? He's in the stomach of gluttony, in the stomach of envy. You know what I mean? Two stomachs! Look, we're right there. These guys, these are homunculus, be careful. That's what she's looking for? Is wondering, he's like, are we like oppositions? Like, oh, you know, not opposition, but you know, we're not on the same side. She can feel it, the aura. Even Lin meant Lin, like, he mentioned things like that, like, you know, the place, it gives bad vibes, you know, bad feelings. Shall make it feel it. Aww. The sewers? What? Bones? Aren't these just all these dead bodies? Keep keepers. Oh, but that means X and then we're gonna get attacked? Hopefully X and um, but they're coming? I need to see your father. I hope. Oh, man. Oh, how would this feel? I like, could it, guys? And come on, Al, think of Al. Philosopher's Stone? Look, he's adding everything up! Wait... Look. He got something! What type of monster is What that look like a dragon? What the heck? The gatekeepers are no joke. Look like dragons. Could you. Oh, they're chimeras. Cerberus? Could you imagine you mistakenly walk into here? 
But you know what? Honestly, how's that a mistake? You're going into somewhere like this? Why would you even continue going? Worse? Yo, I want to see the father? I'm, like, I want to see the face! I'm so desperate! Isn't that Hohenheim, guys? That's not Hohenheim! That's Hohenheim, yo! They brainwash these kids? Look at how Bradley goes. Look at young Bradley though! These doctors! Look at this! I'm trying to understand, right? Look at this. So they injected homunculus into him or something like that. He was human. They injected it? Look at that. That's sad to an extent if you think about it. Not even to an extent, to the maximum. It's true. That's true as well. That's true. I mean, I guess you have to be happy with what you are, who you are. What are you going to do?
Human transmutation. Look at that. What? What the heck? This sounds so dangerous! Uh, it's risky. But you know, it's better than being stuck here. Working with our enemies. Okay. Exactly, that's... Man! They did? That's how dirty... God, God, you, I, you know, I added this up last episode. As soon as they brought up the war. I was like, it makes sense. It all adds. Philosopher's Stone, many dead bodies. A whole, you know, country. Look at that. A trade! Envy, I don't trust you though. You can just, we can just grab it. Yo, can you, <laughs> oh my gosh. These guys just kill me, you know? I feel bad though, cause you know, they're, they're all You. Come on. We're doing it now? <laughs> Lynn, like you're gonna make it. Don't worry, that ain't gonna happen. To what? Almost.
almost like a prayer to God. Oh, in interesting, you know, even th that's true, I never even thought about it like that. You know, it doesn't really sink to me like that. Please tell me it's working. Wow. That speaks numbers. Thank you. They're being saved. stuff it's arm and leg he's like you want it back please I came right back to the gate be something you know like it's an egg What the heck? But you know, good to... Yo! <laughs> Yo! Wait! What? Guys, I can't even lie, this is incredible! You know! Whoa! Whoa! What the heck? What the heck, yo? You see, this whole scenario with the gate of truth and this dude, like this, that dude, you know, we, we don't see his face, who supposedly, like, I, I guess I'll just call him God, just to call him that, for this situation. Like, he's their world's God, or something like that, or the God of truth, or something. He, well, you know, Ed, used his mind, since we're in this, we're going through this portal, he's using his mind to get into the gates, where, where the time came where he lost Al and stuff like that, and was separated, losing his body, and whatnot. He cut right in the same situation, he sees Al, I didn't notice that was Al at first, because he looks like Ed, you know what I mean? Al, Ed, they look like their brothers, so I'm like, wait, what the heck, is this supposed to be Ed? Then it sticks to me, I'm like, yo, that's Al, what the heck, and Al, Al's like, I can't come with you, because, you know, you're not my soul. So now I'm kind of thinking in my head, let's say it was Al in that situation, could he have taken it? Because, like, I, I'm your soul, bro, I'm your soul in this body, come to me, I'm you, you know what I mean? But no, Ed go, Ed goes like, wait on me, bro, wait, I'm gonna come back and I'm gonna get you. 
This is incredible. Just seeing this journey. That's the thing I'm loving about Full Metal Alchemist right now. Because it's like, you know, at times, like right now we're in the pits of hell. And what I mean by that is like, look at what's going on with Mustang and Bradley. Bradley showed you he's top dog. Even though he told us this whole story about how he was made into this homunculus. And you know, honestly, that's the, that's pretty sad what he went through. You know what I mean? And why I say it's sad, like they brainwashed him. There was all these people being brainwashed, yo, into, to be the, you know, to be the king, you know? That's crazy. I didn't know, like, he, I, he was human at first. I didn't know that was the case. I thought he was always homunculus, made into homunculus, homunculus. But no, he was always human. They injected the serum into him, and he became a homunculus, you know what I mean? And was forged into this king. And it just, and a part of that, I'm assuming, that was all the military, because the military wanted a king. So look what this shows you, right? The military was crafted on the homunculus. It shows you the whole system is corrupt. No one is to be trusted, you know what I mean? Just like when Mustang went to those guys. I feel like Mustang was rushing too much of the situation. He should have handled things slowly, kicked back, you know what I mean? Played things like chess. And I feel like when you see that part, like Mustang taking all those losses in chess, I feel like that kind of goes to an extent of showing. Because it's like, he's too hasty with things. He needs to be slow. And because of that, everyone's being separated separated, sent to different places, western, northern, and Hawkeye, my baby Hawkeye, being sent to central with the freaking devil himself. But you know what? I'm not gonna call Mustang, not Mustang, but Bradley the devil, because you know, Bradley to an extent, like, showed signs, like, of, you know, sympathy and a heart. You know what I mean? Like, when he was talking about, like, maybe we should give the kids the throne to an extent, something like that, or something amongst those lines. Like, and you know, like, whoever he was talking to, I don't know who, they said, you know, that's like treachery, you could be punished for that. Like, he's showing, like, you know, I don't know, to a heart or something, you know? Because if you think about it, he was forced and brainwashed to live in a certain lifestyle, so I can't really blame him for that. Because, you know, that's how he was raised, that's how it worked out for him, you know? Sadly. But, as you can see, he's, be like they said, you're becoming more human, and I, I don't know, let's see how that goes. Maybe Bradley won't be too bad and he could change for the better. Maybe that, I mean, I'm hoping that's the case that we don't have to kill him, but maybe we will have to kill him. Who knows what could go down here. But these four episodes were just incredible. Just, you know, capturing gluttony. Uh, you see the thing with Fullmetal Alchemist, you always learn the bits of information. Just like, you know, what we learned here. Gluttony has the gates, the gate right there, or even learning about the military. And learning that how to create a gate and perfecting everything. I still need to see, you know their father, like the homunculus' father, but I'm definitely like screwing my head, it's, you know, Hohenheim, yo. What the heck? Why is it Hohenheim? Yo, I think it's Hohenheim, but I could be wrong, that's the thing. It's like, I, I'm like positive, I'm like in my head, it's Hohenheim, but I could be wrong. I don't know, guys. I don't know what the heck too much is going on. Not like too much is going on, like I'm not able to capture it, but too much is going on is crazy. It's so much hype, you know what I mean? Like I'm getting everything that's going on right now, but it's like, wow. Oh my goodness, I'm loving it. You know, for the sake of this video, me talking any longer is gonna just make this rendering process much more longer by minutes, hours, who knows. So I'm gonna cut it short right here. We did four episodes of that Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood. Greatness. I want to watch more though, cause what you call? I feel like definitely next episode we're seeing the father, yo. What? The, that's the thing, cause it's like ne next episode, Blaney just opened doors, and you know, and Ed, he's coming back. Is he gonna come out like throw out of Blaney's mouth or something? You know what I mean? That's what I want to know. <sighs> I have to end it here though. I have to end it here, guys. No way. Thanks for watching. If you made it to the end, you're amazing, yo. Peace out. Someone's here with me. A class salmon. What? Get off me! What the heck? What the? What the heck? Look at you guys! Come on, let's do it.